Hi, I'm Claudia McKenna and I'm here to give you fabulous tips to make a gorgeous St. Patrick's Day party. Um, I'm a chef and cookbook author and I guess my number one tip um, when I'm throwing um, a, a party, no matter what time of the year it is actually, I always make sure that I source a really good cream liqueur. Um, I love this Kerrygold Irish cream liqueur. It's my favourite actually. Um, a lot of you folks will know the Kerrygold brand. They make that beautiful butter, those cheeses like Dubliner and Skelligs, I've been reared on those products, I love them and they come from you know beautiful, you know the products are made from beautiful milk that comes from Ireland on outdoor grass fed you know cows and so you know when you've got ingredients that good the taste is going to be sensational and in these ingredients, uh, in this beautiful cream liqueur they have those pure ingredients as well, it's real chocolate aged whiskey and gorgeous cream all mixed together to create a sensational cream liqueur. Um, so I absolutely love this. Um, it's available now across America, which is very exciting. So you can all get your hands on it. It's in over 40 states. And very uh, a big congratulations actually with Kerry Gold because they've won the World Drink Awards for the best cream liqueur. And I couldn't agree more with the critics. I'm with them on that. Um, so I'm gonna show you how to make two really fun um, recipes if you're hosting a party or if you've got people coming over for dinner. Um, the first one is the espresso martinis. This is really fun and kind of decadent. Um, there's three ingredients, so it's a take three recipe. You need um, a shaker or else just get a large glass and fill it with ice. Then you pour in the delicious cream liqueur and then you put in a measurement of vodka, like so. And then next you put in some good espresso coffee or you know, or good strong coffee in there. And then let the fun begin. Shaking, cocktail hour. <laughs> and then you strain it out, holding back the ice cubes and pour it into some chilled glasses. And that's another tip. Chill your glasses before you pop your cocktail mixture in. It's very simple to do. Just pop them into the freezer and they'll chill within like an hour or so. Then I'm decorating it with um, those lovely cocoa beans um, on top or coffee beans and grated chocolate and voila, schlointa. The smell is beautiful, chocolate, dreamy, coffee and the texture is so creamy. Now my next recipe is a beautiful decadent dessert. Um, again, like all the recipes that we have, it's very um, simple, it's foolproof. Um, like this looks like something that you'd get in a really like, you know, fun, amazing restaurant. Um, but it's so simple to make. What you do is you just melt the chocolate in a saucepan over a medium heat. Then you pour in the Kerrygold Irish cream liqueur. Take it off the heat. Then you stir in egg yolks, sugar, and then you fold in some lovely cloudy, you know, um, whisked egg whites to make it lovely and light and fluffy. It comes out looking like this, which you pop into the fridge and you let it set for about an hour or you could do it overnight. So if you're having your party, you know, tomorrow, you get these done tonight and it takes the stress away from everything. Then just before you serve it, I like to put, you know, softly whipped cream on top like so. And then the big finale is you pour the Irish cream liqueur all over it. And look at this. Look how gorgeous that looks. I mean, it's delicious. Um, and then I decorate it with flakes of chocolate all on top. And I'm telling you guys, this is sensational. It's so good, I've got to have a bite of it. Mm. Oh, creamy coffee, caramel flavors. It's so beautiful, a winner winner. You can get this recipe, the cocktail recipe, and lots more recipes from Kerrygold up in Kerrygold irishcream.com. Schlointhe, hope you enjoy them.